हाय तो कंपनी का नाम गली है एंड व्हाट वी डू इज की इंडिया में जितने भी आर्ट फॉर्म है ट्रेडिशनल आर्ट फॉर्म उसको हम ऑथेंटिकली डिफरेंट डिफरेंट स्ट्रीट से लेके आकर स्ट्रीट वेयर में लाते हैं सो इट्स ए री इनोवेशन ऑफ दी ओल्डर आर्ट फॉर्म बट फॉर द न्यू जनरेशन तो दैट इज वॉट वी डू सो आई वेंट टू जयपुर एंड वहाँ पे देखा कि इंडियन वेयर जो पहले महाराजा लोग डेली बेसिस पे पहनते थे आज का जनरेशन ओनली वेज ऑन दिवाली और ओनली वेज इट ऑन यू नो शादियों के टाइम पे तो वो जो डिसकंटिन्यूएशन था एंड द वे इंडियन आर्ट्स वॉज बींग सीन फॉर यंगर जनरेशन वी वॉन्टेड टू गैप दैट एंड स्ट्रीट वेयर जो बाहर की चीज़ थी जो इंडिया में भी इतना चल रहा है वाई नॉट शो इंडिया स्टोरी टू द वर्ल्ड यू नो अबाउट आव आर आर्ट फॉर्म्स फ्रॉम आर ओन स्ट्रीट्स कैन गो दैट तो दैट्स करेक्ट सो दो तीन चीज़ें हैं नंबर वन द लॉर्ड ऑफ पीपल विद द लॉर्ड ऑफ मार्केटिंग नॉलेज द लॉर्ड ऑफ एक्सपर्टीज इन द इंडस्ट्री तो ऑब्वियसली उनके इंसाइट्स बहुत हेल्पफुल होते हैं उनके नज़रिया बिकॉज उन्होंने चार पाँच साल ज़्यादा बिजनेस किया है दस साल किया है जीरो टू वन किया जीरो टू हंड्रेड किया है तो वो वैल्यू एड बहुत ज़्यादा है सेकेंडली वी आर रेजिंग फंड राइट नाउ सो वे लुकिंग एट रफली सेवेंटी फाइव लैक्स फॉर फिफ्टीन परसेंट डायल्यूशन एंड पीपल हैव बिन वेरी सपोर्टिव यूर so even if it is not via them they're linking me to more people who can help me in both the aspects so yeah it's really supportive environment i'm glad to be a part of it awesome as a young entrepreneur you should follow him you know this is the only hobby apne aapse hello hi guys so what i'm going to do is i'm going to give one box to each row I request you all to just open and take a look at what we're selling. Check it, and uh, yeah, thank you. And I'll explain what we're doing. Yeah. So uh, I am Abhimanyu. I am the founder of this company called Gali. Uh, on surface, what we do is we take streetwear, uh, we take Indian arts and craft from across India, and we authentically bring it on streetwear. So we've done three collections yet, and uh, if you look at the products, there's Fulkari from Punjab. Uh, we did a Bengal collection where it's hand stitched katha on streetwear, and then we did another collection where we did an art form from Palestine on streetwear. So this is the first time that India has been doing it. Now, why are we doing it? What prompted us to do it is what I'm going to share. So 10 years ago, roughly, streetwear came to India, and a lot of companies made a lot of money. Now it was not seen before because the print techniques, they all that was very very new. So the T-shirts that were earlier sold at three thousand, four thousand rupees are now being sold at four five hundred rupees. Correct, the value proposition is gone. But who clientele and customer base really have? Who wants something new and fresh in that industry? So we came about this idea about how about making streetwear Indian, presenting India story to the world in our own version of streetwear. So that's how we came about this. In terms of what we have achieved, so we've been ten months in operations. We've done three collections. The idea of these ten months was to understand if there is a product market fit. Very simply, so we tested out between the price range of 2500 to okay. So the segment we operate is in between 2500 to 6000 roughly. So it's not about the premium segment, and uh, we operate at a GM1 of roughly 70% and a GM2 of 20-25% gas pass. So the whole idea was to understand who is our audience, where are we selling it, who is buying it. Um, the 18 to 25 audience we figured uh, likes between the price range of 25 to 3000 and so on. A surprising price, uh, surprising audience we unlocked was between 30 to 45, which has been moving very heavily in retail stores across India where we've been selling as well. So we're in shops across Mumbai, uh, Delhi, Hyderabad, Chennai, Ahmedabad. And all of those shops have been active since the last two months. We've been doing roughly a lakh almost in each store, Bilal uh, Jawagir. Um, online, we've been selling through our website. Uh, we've maintained, so we've put in roughly 10 lakhs in the company so far. We have our own manufacturing unit. Uh, it's in Park Circus, 
Uh, we put in roughly 1.8 to 2 lakh rupees in marketing so far till date, and we made total revenue of 12 lakhs in these uh, 10 months or so. But now we know the areas we want to expand into, the uh, places we go, want to you know, move into. So the ask here is roughly 75 lakhs for 15%. Uh, We've got an offer of 20 lakhs at the 5 CR valuation. And uh, another big point that I'm missing out is export is a huge, huge market. Uh, if India is looking at a 1000 CR, a dressable market. And I'm very realistic. Hai, huh? So we can do 1000 crore market in India. Mein kar sakte hai. Abroad, there is 10,000 crore ka market. Hai. I'll ask you to check out a few brands later. It's called Rasta from Pakistan and stuff like that. So these guys, they made a huge business on South Asian culture being outside. You might have to start with, you know, your products being white labeled initially, but there is a huge market and we're getting orders as well right now. So I think I'll open the round for uh, question answers if anybody has any. Just raise your hands. Do you have any questions? Yes, sir. So at the moment we are doing 60% uh, is online uh, and uh, the rest 20% has been um, 30 sorry 40% has been offline. How's your CAC? So CAC uh, initially uh, we were doing at roughly 2000, but the past three months, four months, six months in fact we've been at thousand and below. What do you said your growth margin? 70%. GM one. So that T-shirt is at 3300. Yeah. What is the cost of the entry? So the cost to create one. Yeah. So the cost of creating one just the good uh, before shipping and before uh, is roughly 650 rupees. And uh, that is also because we're doing it at a lower scale right now. We've understood the demand is there. The stocks have been selling out. So we've sold out all our inventory yet. Uh, so. We honestly need the money to create more stuff because you need an amount of money to create more inventory, right? So that is what we are mainly looking at with money for acquisition. Um, let us say each collection sells out um, in 45 days. 45 days. And retailers are pressed out? One month cycle from the retailer. So, our first cycle is done. Next first to sale report. How much is the return from the retailer? Uh, they take a 30% markdown. Return, 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 so, um, January, we've done 12. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, 12 lakhs. Is it monthly or yearly? No, so these six months you've done 12 lakhs. The ARR for the rest of the year is another uh, 30 we're looking at. So, trying to close the year at 50. Yeah, yeah. So, you're doing marketing and 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 you're doing my USP, then? So, nobody in India is doing it right now. Uh, there is innovation in the product uh, with geopolitical tagging and branding. Uh, what Hardcore did was a very simple Kuala Lumpur on this. We can do it on a much bigger scale to the world in India. Pardon? Simona Complex. Ah, so that's why you need your money, sir. No, but it is not your Complex. Yeah, but of course, yeah. So, what is your USP? It's five lakhs. So how do how you find yourself when uh, you are starting against the uh, soul store? Soul store se aapko, uh, how? They, for what I know, they follow the theme, like Marvel or yeah, you know, but what is the exact USP? So how you are going to pitch? So how you differentiate yourself? So unka price range alag hai. Uh, they operate between 990 and 1000 rupees. Uh, sure, but the Marvel you are seeing. So that is the main price range they're looking at. Uh, we are more of a uh, we're a different segment in terms of what the product is offering. You don't get Kanta uh, Stitch on streetwear there, and uh, this is more of uh, this is very different brand. I mean, of course, streetwear is coming, but as I said, there are some bad brands.
how many, uh, so you are trying to build a cult around the system or you are already pitching into a cult which already exists? So you are building a new cult or a cult which already exists? Alright, so um, it's very simple, India has streetwear always had that. So you need to create a lot of air around the brand. Um, so there is an existing market who has been buying from us and this age, this hover he said, is between 18 to 25. So, so far because of the pricing we understood we were mainly looking at 26 plus people. But now we have new, uh, you know, ways of hitting the product in the market better. Uh, they don't value the Fulkari as much, they like the design. But the Fulkari brings their edge to buy them. Uh, um, because I have so much history and story going on, if I bring my prices a little lower, they are willing to pay 500 to 700 more for mine. So, yeah, looks at both the markets. Is it male and female both or Yeah, it's UAS. Yes. Uh, are you guys looking for vertical integration or vertical integration expanding, expanding or like horizontal expansion? Different products SKUs or like the same product and multiple journals? Um, so right now we're building, uh, we have identified our silhouettes and structures. We want to build um, and expand for the different age crowds like I said. And we want to try different design iterations. Um, so yeah, that's what we're looking at right now. So how do you do the marketing in the future? Online store? What is the idea? So the idea is that we want to move into roughly 25 uh, retail stores by the end of the year. All premium super end of course. And uh, we also want to move into brand building that involves, of course, a lot of celebrity sightings. So we already have a lot of them, but a little more of that. Uh, we want to hire a few uh, more people to help us build more content. So influencers, you are looking at influencers? Not just influencers, sir. That's a very small uh, word. Uh, but uh, more into organic content creation. And just the story of the brand is what is the most powerful aspect here. And if that sits with the people, I'm sure they'll go ahead with it. Are you presenting any e-commerce platform like Mintra or anything? Uh, no, sir, we're not doing Mintra, Amazon right now. Uh, I don't want to. Uh, so, in India, for it to be seen as premium, uh, and, you know, to be seen by that crowd who's paying. Mintra have a luxury, uh, luxury premium brand. True, we've been reached out by Ajio, luxury and everything, but our stocks do not permit us to keep uh, that inventory with them right now. And that's the second thing, you ask one more thing, that is, uh, you are saying that you are the only player in this field. But Tabi is already there. Tabi? There is a brand called Tabi. Okay. They are also selling Ajrak prints and other prints. Ah, sir, so Ajrak prints to new market to me. So, you uh, will get that clothes every place. But uh, that's not exactly streetwear, right? Uh, what we are offering is uh, everything from scratch. And not just from scratch, but uh, just the value that brings. Have you ever seen Katha on a shirt like this before? Uh, I don't know, a shirt yeah, on anybody. So, Thanks again. Thank you. 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 देखते चान बाह अपना लग जरी ये लोगों इवेंट पे आस्ते चान अवश्य अवश्य हम लोगों से तो कोला पुरुष करते पड़े वो विशेष गाने नीचे डिस्क्रिप्शन में लिंक दबाओ अवश्य अवश्य आस्ते सबसे एक पर तो भूल जाना तारे नमस्कार आज कैसे